Hello everyone, hope you're all doing well. Don't forget, if you like the video, click on like and subscribe and talk about it on chat lines, wherever it is your social media activities and help us to grow and help more people. I'll talk to you soon. Slobodan says, um, why I just can't be my old self? Well, because you're never old self. <laughs> you're always improving. But I know what you mean. But you can because if you cannot, if you seem you think you cannot be your old self because you've forgotten who the boss is, because you are being influenced by thoughts and what emotions thought can induce or carry as it is programmed to without consultation with you who you are, brain produces thoughts and thoughts are connected and induce emotions, but none of them have anything to do with you, yet you think your identity or how your mood is, is dependent on the directive that you receive from the brain, while the brain itself is simply an apparatus, and you've forgotten that it works for you, like your intestine, it has a job to do, yet you take its productions including what it does good and what it is supposed to be got rid of like your intestine need to get rid of the feces and the brain also in its production of its duties it also creates feces and those feces are intrusive thoughts and yet you think those are your mandates rather than the fact that you are the boss and you are the ultimate power in allowing anything produced by your brain to see the light of day or fall by the wayside because you're the only one who can allow it to have any life to it any actuality to it so that is why it's kind of a little bit sometimes seems to you i can't be my old self you can you're just being bamboozled by your own belief about the role of brain in your entity as if it's more than you are, as if it dictates who you are, as if it can reach you, as if it actually is your intellect. It's not. In the video that I have produced, Are You or the Brain is the You?, which is based on the experiments of Dr. Spiri, Dr. Penfield, Dr. Owen, Dr. Leibet. These are all world-class Nobel Prize researchers at that echelon of research through neuroscience and neurosurgery they have proven beyond the shadow of the doubt scientifically that the brain there are aspects of you that the brain cannot reach brain is not an intellect there is no center for mathematics in your brain there is no center for compassion in your brain there is no center there's no way they can reach your consciousness manipulate it, change it, or your character, hmm? or your gender, who you are. The brain is just a tool, but you don't see it that way. You've been conditioned and bamboozled to think brain is you. Brain is not you, you're not the brain. And Dr. Schwartz in his book, Brain Lock, has shown it to all. So anyhow, let's, uh, let's move on. And so if you are focused on the fact that you are the main character, not apparatuses of you, not your liver, not your kidney, not your brain, not your intestine, then you know the hierarchy and you can always be who you want to be, who you don't want to be, based on your ultimate power, which is based on and is rooted in your vetoes and your choices. Not what the suggestions and ideas and thoughts and images that the brain pumps up into your head. Subscribe on my channel, visit my channel, and go through the videos that you might be interested in. Mindatseekstruth.com is making it one step away to talk to me one-on-one -on, -one on Skype and discuss what's concerning you. I'll talk to you soon.